that's the really great thing about our relationship is that like, you know, we're sort of like yin and yang. We're, we're, okay. we're alike in many ways and see eye to eye on a lot of things, but then also are like very different people. So I think, you know, it's, it's when we're writing music, not only lyrically, but creatively to have two different viewpoints, you know, it's like they say two heads are better than one often. So it's like Tom will see something in a completely different way than I'll see it. And I'll see something different. And, you know, whether it's the lyrics or how a kick drum sounds or anything like we come together and that's the collaboration of the band, you know? Every once in a while, we'll look at each other and say, dude, if you if, if somebody gave you an infinite amount of money, what would you change right now? And mm -hmm. oftentimes the answer is, is we would do the exact same thing, except maybe have a nicer house or a nicer car, mm -hmm. or something material and stupid. But as far as making music is concerned, we, that's always the part that never changes, you know? So I think it's, it's, it's for us, it's about, it's always about trying to write the best music that we possibly can at the time, you know? Mm -hmm. um, and that we've noticed that that's something, you know, your influences change, your inspirations change, but it's, it's, you know, trying to be honest and, you know, a lot of people say great art is sort of this uncompromising thing, but I think there's something natural in collaboration that happens where when you give in a little bit and, and, get, and allow someone else's ideas the chance to sort of to, to grow, that there's something extremely, not only humbling, but also very powerful in that, you know?